Welcome, my friends. Welcome to the show. This is the show. So here we had a subscriber commenting on uh, this one in Nebraska. And I told him it looked just like this one, Mount Kalash. All right, so that's the, uh, that was actually being prepared. And so it always helps when you guys suggest something. Mount Kalash, made of bricks. Did you know? So if you don't believe me, here's a closer look. You can see for yourself. It's a rock curtain covered, covering the brick walls of that building that was cooked. And these are layers of bricks, totally cooked out. Here's a nice square corner for you there, Mount Kalash. There's a closer look at it. Uh, I took these pictures from a number of sources and you're gonna see coming up. Here you have people walking underneath, but for sure over and over there you have red brick. That's big clumps of it anyway would be a pocket of survival there. Here you have the pagoda system in and around Mount Kalash. And uh, how many stories is that? Two, four, six, seven, seven. Plus the dome. Look at the size. This is actually a low quality photo. I'm going to switch to the high quality in a second. But that is a dog. So you could get a picture of how large these buildings actually are. They're huge. Here we go. Straight from Gallica. You can see the little dog tied to the to the tree. And we're gonna see some people in these photos. With the but the look at the the door on that's a what we would call Arabic or something like that, like the Middle Eastern for sure. But this would be closer to India and China. And you can see for yourself, I don't know if that's uh, someone's attempt to get up there with those ropes. But uh, I was uh, doing the research already and um, watched a bunch of videos about Mount Kalash um, yesterday. And I realized I had already covered it with the Oh, when the one that, that they were saying that in India that that was carved out, Mankala. Mankala. So this is the second video I'm covering the area in the India. What's technically China now? Just going with what they give us. Looking it's all techy out in the back there with that cone structure thing. That looks like purpose, like a, has utility. Here, this looks, this looks more like a stone carving. Here, you see the people. It's not very large, but probably more likely it's not. Um, so this is a close up of a corner of a photo right here. You can see for yourself the ruins, but the ruins over there looking more like a cathedral, like what something we would see in Europe. Here. What I thought might be just a leaning, what might be leaning over. It's hard to tell, all the buildings are sort of crooked. A close up, it's a brick wall covered in mud or, or some sort of plaster covering, facade covering. Interesting how these brick, how these like little pockets come scooping out the side of the building there, that's cool. Um, here's one I fixed up. This was just a ghost of an image. All right, so pagoda system again with the golden top and no chains coming down. So I don't see the chains or any kind of pagoda system thing. So it was probably just damaged, this one, cooked. Here we have the two spires again, but a pagoda system. I'm not seeing any chains on that one either from the top. Here's the temple I covered last time they said was carved. And this is a Google Earth video. Enough to find this really awesome panoramic view of the area. Hey, this is just not some geological formation. 
throughout here. This is beginning to look like something that's been intelligently designed. Let's take a closer look. This is the first enhancement I made of the area and really all I did was make it larger and I adjusted the lighting to bring out detail. You can see there's a foot range. It's, uh, it's just spectacular. And I'm going to do more work on this, but I thought it was important to get out for the naysayers to beat there it the is hell on out the of me on this. But I'm sticking with this one. Mount Kalash. Well, uh, but let me also say thank you for the people who subscribe and, and all the kind people. See the bridges. That make this channel so wonderful to be a part of. Um, I'm a little, I'm a little fluster today I, I this this thing has this is roger in kansas city that's what i believe it looked like where it's cold as you would have had a golden top with dignity and restraint their features There's are his, that's his uh channel the women are striking to see will be something that i shall be cherishing for long i was told and true to his words it was magical. Barry, did you catch that? Did you see that in the foreground? I there am a, an atheist. Some buried building right there. And yet, Audio I was croppings too. Stained Where red. Lord Shiva is believed to reside, carry for this place. I take this quite seriously. You I don't uh, question all due respect their belief. to their religion and culture. You just, I am wise. In all humility, great Shiva. Lord Shiva bless at me on this plane. A boat. And I hope you can uh, show us your golden eye. Once periodic of formation of faces, but what I'm really spot, looking at in a lot of ways, or you would spot a figure looking at Kailash, is uh, right across the street from an there. itself, other walk revealed a swastika. Could be swastika. Can you spot Nandi here? Obviously, a whole series of buildings. Now you might question these signs, like many. It's completely up to you. Look at the rainbow. Perfect. A perfect rainbow right over that. But one thing is sure: that Kailash Mansarovar Yatra is one journey that I still cherish, and will continue to cherish for a. So, in all respect, Lord Shiva, that is your resting place the right navel in the navel. of the world. The most sacred mountain in Tibet, Mount Kailash, which has never been climbed. The only problem is that the trek begins in Darchan at 4,600 meters. <clears throat> to it is an... In numbers, numbers, running from numbers. A monasteries built many hundreds, sometimes thousands of years ago, stand in defiance of Here's the elements, what I look like, precariously probably. placed among the clouds. Among the seemingly endless mountain ranges lay one mountain which is different Resonator according to ancient with a chain. beliefs. Shiva, Mount there Kailash. he is. It is indeed regarded within the climbing world as unascendable. These ancient clusters of may, however, be ulterior motives and a possible suppressionance of a giant man made pyramid of great antiquity. Just how old this pyramid could be currently remains unclear. What also remains unclear is if the entire mountain is a man made pyramid, disguised by the erosion of many millennia. The research that's the not ancient, that's having... just uh, newer, actually. He's got that backwards. You see all the rubble at the bottom, that means they blew it up. Here's what I found. Right in the side of the mountain there. So screenshots from the channel bottom right, see? One of those videos. Click, 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 I got a bunch of them. Here yeah, you can see right in there, steps going in that one. Double, 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 two, two windows at a time. Right here. That's what he says is there, there, that is that. <sighs> They're placed like that in special order, just like the Last Supper. I mean, 
people know what they're looking at when they see that from a mile away they can recognize it that's what i mean by that it's a bit of a longer video today but uh, it did i got tripped up <laughs> i didn't realize how much there was to cover on this one so that's what i'm talking about right across look how squared off that is the mountain at the top and it's got a pointy roof it should that thing should be golden it's probably used to be golden All right, so compressed, cooked out building. Looking a lot like Mount Meru, except maybe it's more four-sided. That's what I'm looking at. I might follow up with that one. You're not supposed to even uh, consider climbing this mountain. It's, it goes, it's, it's against the spiritual realm of it. But I'm pretty sure these people are on the same page as us. They know something's up with this. The Chinese control it now. They're making a wise decision not to mess with this place. This is probably what uh, the tunnels look like inside. It's more of a building with a central access in the middle. I can only guess. I can only go with what they tell us here. So there was a lot to cover in this video. Thanks if you've made it this far and you haven't subscribed already. Help a bogan out. Subscribe. Share the video out. Um, I usually wait to the very end to kind of say stuff like that because I find it annoying when I watch videos. Here you go. But if you look below those white resonator things, it's a brick wall. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. And because of the layers and everything, it really does shine when the sun hits it the right way. At the top, it can sparkle kind of thing, like look white. Because of the bottom stripes are red, you'll see in a second this mountain. So, I think I'm taking off from the last one. You can actually look at that rock there. It has bricks popping out of it right there. Here, this is another resonator with the chains coming from the top. <coughs> <coughs> and square looking buildings at the bottom there underneath. Those are probably 1850 circa, circa like the squared off buildings. I don't think those are that old. You know what I'm saying, last two centuries ago, like uh, 1870, something like that. The square buildings, they didn't even bother making them in this area of the world. Here, this one would be a newer building. Yeah. Resonator with chains coming off it. There's the top of the mountain. Mount Kailash. Kailash. That's what it looks like from all sides. It's almost like a grand entrance on that one side there, huh? So, here, I, for the rest of the video, I'm looking at it from all different angles, the mountain. Um, if you want to watch to the end, I start measuring and stuff. I'm going to call it there, though. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments. I'm pretty good about uh, answering questions or giving my two cents. I appreciate your comments and, and uh, your uh, suggestions. Usually fits perfectly right in with what I'm looking at already. So here I'm just going around the outside of the mountain there. And um, at this point, I think I wasn't looking at so much across the street the one that was uh, pointy at the top and all that stuff anyway thank you guys take care bye